so uh, just a few days ago guys uh, i was actually on the nike website trying to uh, uh, buy some uh, running equipment and uh, for my surprise they were actually just uploading uh, the new version for a very well known uh, uh, trail running shoe so of course i had to take it uh, to bring you guys a brand new review Hello guys and welcome back for a brand new review if you are new to the channel please make sure you're gonna subscribe you can also give me a follow on instagram to see exactly what i'm gonna review in the next few days in today's video guys uh, we're gonna have a look at this uh, brand new uh, running uh, trail shoes so let's go ahead and also take them out of the box which as you can see this time will come in this uh, brown box with the nike swoosh here on the top of course as this one will be a trail shoe we're gonna have a lot of uh, very interesting uh, drawings uh, here on the sides so let's go ahead and just take them out so in today's video guys uh, we're gonna have a look at this uh, brand new release for the nike uh, pegasus trail 4 <music> So uh, this one guys uh, was released on the Nike website in the last week of May at least here in the UK for the retail price of £115 which if I'm not mistaken it's uh, the same price as the previous one but of course uh, guys uh, for this new version as you can see we're gonna have a totally a new design which will have roughly the same materials but in my opinion this one feels a bit uh, dull and uh, it's not gonna be as interesting as the previous uh, version and uh, for now guys uh, we're gonna have this uh, new version for the Pegasus Trail uh, just in this uh, color combination which uh, it's uh, a strange one I'm not a big fan of but most definitely Nike will bring us some new color combination uh, in the next uh, few weeks if not days so uh, let's go ahead and also do a breakdown of this one guys so as you can see for the upper we're gonna have this uh, rugged mesh material which will actually have uh, another layer underneath but this one as you can see will uh, be present for most of the upper and will have a lot of uh, holes for a uh, good breathability and this one will still have those rubberized uh, dots uh, here at the front which apparently are there to try and uh, keep this material from ripping but as you go uh, towards the lacing system guys uh, you can see that we're gonna have a major improvement for this one they actually decided uh, to bring us uh, the fly wire which uh, as you might know or not uh, it will embrace uh, your whole foot uh, quite uh, good so i guess uh, this one is actually a very good improvement but we're still gonna have uh, these uh, cutout holes in these uh, materials here so it's not gonna be just the fly wire as in for the actual laces guys for this one we're gonna have these uh, blue ones with uh, these hints of white in it and just underneath these laces guys uh, we're gonna have this uh, well padded tongue i would say uh, it's not gonna be too much and on this one we're also gonna have this rubberized uh, overlay which will have a pegasus trail for written on the middle but as you get now in the midfoot guys you can see that uh, for the lateral side we're gonna have this uh, volt green uh, nike swoosh frame which uh, for the medial side uh, is not going to be present uh, for this one we're going to have this uh, trail logo imprinted in this uh, orange color and we're also going to have written uh, nike uh, trail uh, just uh, above the nike swoosh and on the other side uh, we're also going to have written uh, fly wire but now as you go uh, to the back of the shoe guys you can see that we're gonna have uh, covering the whole uh, ankle section a different uh, material which will be uh, slightly a bit uh, stiffer than the rest of the mesh used uh, throughout uh, inside of the shoe guys where you can see that we're gonna have this uh, gray uh, lining and uh, just underneath this lining we're gonna have a good amount of padding i wouldn't say that uh, it's uh, gonna be too much and of course uh, at the bottom we're gonna have this uh, orange uh, rubber uh, insole which will also have this uh, very big uh, nike swoosh imprinted on it 
And now guys uh, we can go to this uh, grey uh, react foam midsole which uh, as you can see it's completely changed comparing with the Pegasus Trail 3. So this one will not be as uh, wide as the Trail 3. In my opinion this one uh, really feels that uh, it's uh, toned down uh, comparing with the Pegasus Trail 3. It's not gonna be as uh, aggressive as that one. And now guys uh, we can finish with this uh, rubber outsole in this uh, green color. Which uh, comparing with the Pegasus Trail 3 uh, it has a lot of uh, this uh, React midsole exposed. Which I guess uh, it will let uh, this uh, whole uh, shoe uh, flex more than the previous one of course. And uh, this one is uh, completely redesigned and uh, as you can see it has a very raised uh, pattern. Which I guess it will be just perfect for the trails. But in my opinion uh, this uh, part here at the heel section has a lot of uh, foam exposed. Which uh, I guess uh, if you're gonna use it uh, properly on the trails uh, this one will get pierced uh, quite easily. So I I'm not a big fan of that. As in for the actual sizing guys, for this one I went with my true to size which I've also done with the Pegasus Trail 3 and for me as I have with skinny feet this one fits me just fine and I guess it will be roughly the same for people with normal feet but just in case you have a wider feet I would suggest you to go either with your true to size or even try out a half size up just to make sure that this one is not gonna be too snug on your foot. So overall guys uh, this uh, new uh, version for this uh, Nike Pegasus Trail in my opinion uh, it uses roughly the same materials as the previous one. Of course uh, we got introduced this uh, fly wire for the lacing system which I really felt that it's embracing quite nicely my uh, foot when uh, tightening the shoelaces. But to be honest this uh, new design uh, for me it doesn't uh, look as good as the previous one. And at least in this color combination most definitely this one uh, I uh, don't uh, enjoy it as much. Uh, I, it really feels that uh, it got uh, slightly a bit uh, lighter than the previous one. And I really hope that uh, Nike will uh, bring uh, some uh, more color combinations uh, on the market soon. And in the next uh, few days guys I will actually make a direct uh, comparison between uh, this uh, Pegasus Trail 4 and the uh, previous one the Pegasus Trail 3 so make sure you're gonna subscribe to the channel to see that one. So uh, yeah guys this was my unboxing and reviewing of this uh, new version for the Nike Pegasus uh, Trail 4. I really hope you've enjoyed this video and if you did uh, don't forget to press the like button maybe also subscribe to the channel. You can also give me a follow on Instagram to see exactly what I'm gonna review in the next few days and as always I will see you in my next one. Thanks for watching.